Breaking news, my country people. This is getting more serious. Guys, it be like say, he get waiting President Tinibu they really hide though. It be like say, Tinibu get some kind cockroach for a cupboard. Because, what's all this? President Bola admit Tinibu now have filed a motion to block the U.S. court from releasing his Chicago University records to Atiku Abubakar. That means he has something he's hiding. He's hiding something from Nigerians and he doesn't want us to be aware of it. And we recall, Atiku Abubakar has vowed to expose Tinibu. He has vowed to bring him out all his secrets. Atiku has vowed that he will expose it to Nigerians. So my country people, it's so obvious that uh, Tinibu's life is shrouded in secrecy. For a man like him, who cannot identify any of his former classmates till date, Tinibu has not been able to identify any of his former classmates, someone that claimed he went to school. How can that be possible? So my country people, this is coming after Atiku Abubakar in a recent development. He filed a fresh suit against President Tinibu in the U.S. court over his academic records. Atiku questioned Tinibu's academic record. He wasn't fully convinced that Tinibu actually went to school. He maintained that Tinibu's academic record from primary school till university remained questionable. Ah, uh -uh, how can a president not able to identify a single former classmate. Sure, is it that Tinibu fell from the sky? That he has no classmates? He has no former classmates? This is serious now. Atiku Abubakar vowed to expose Tinibu. He said enough is enough. Oh. The time has come. Tinibu has no hiding place anymore. He will drag his secrets out and he will expose him to the, uh, to, to the public and to Nigerians. But Unano say now, Tinibu now don't go meet the U.S. courts. He has filed a motion to block the U.S. courts from releasing his Chicago University records to Atiku Abubakar. Guys, this is a very, very tough battle. Let's find out more as we hit the news. But if you're joining us for the first time, you're very much welcome. I sincerely appreciate your presence. Kindly subscribe and please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you. President Bola Tinibu has filed a motion seeking to prevent a federal high court in the United States from releasing his university academic records to Atiku Abubakar, the, his principal op opponent, during the Nigeria's February 2023 presidential election. Documents obtained by news reporters showed Atiku Abubakar on August 2nd approached the state district court for the Northern District of Luminous to issue a subpoena to for the Chicago State University to release Bola Tinibu school records, citing the long-standing controversies around the Nigeria's president's background. And it was obtained by a journalist where records showed that a Bola Tinibu that attended this same Chicago University in the 1970s was a female so and tinibu in his results showed that he was a female although the apc said it was a typo error but how come how come they said the only bola tinibu that attended that chicago university in the 1970s was a female though it wasn't a male so how is it possible that tinibu attended this same school and he couldn't in any way identify his former classmates or none of his former classmates could identify themselves and say, oh, they were classmates or to Tinibu in the past. The CSU Registrar's Office had told news reporters that it graduated Ebola Tinibu on June 22, 1979, but did not elaborate when passed on whether the student was a male or female, which less if the same person now is occupying the Nigeria's presidency. Mr. Abubakar, Atiku Abubakar, told the court he was seeking the document as part of the recovery to strengthen his legal challenge against the declaration of 
Wala met Tinibu as the Nigerian president on March 1, 2023, following the hotly contested February 25th election. But Tinibu quickly gathered his team of attorneys and asked to be added as an interest party in the suit, alleging that the Chicago University might be unable to fully protect his interest as the owner of the records being sought. Mr. Tinibu should be allowed to join or intervene because he has a direct personal interest in the record sought. And if his interests are not fully represented or protected by the respondent, which is, which is the Chicago State University, and if his interests his interest will be affected, if he's not permitted to join or intervene, the Nigerian leader argued in his motion to join the suit filed on August 3rd, submitted by his Chicago um, attorney, Mr. Christopher. And the Chicago State University stated that its obligation is satisfied by providing notice of application and attempt to assess the records. The Chicago State's position is that it does not have an obligation to oppose the, uh, the application and therefore the CSU does not adequately represent Mr. Tinibu's interest. The, fal the filing said, Subsequently, Wola Tinibu argued that the record should not be released because they fall under a 1974 privacy law for the American students. And in Atiku Abubakar's lawsuit, it directly seeks relief against Bola Tinibu by seeking his records that the federal and the state governments have determined should be confidential, describing the purpose of the federal educational records and privacy act of the 1974 as to protect students from a school unauthorized release of a student record prohibiting the release the transfer disclosure and the decimation of the school student record the attorneys argued a federal judge has been assigned to the case and both parties anticipated it expedited hearing and disposal, especially after Mr. Tiku Abubakar argued that the Nigerian Election Petitions Tribunal would deliver a verdict around September 21, 2023. Mr. Tiku previously filed a suit before the country's court in Chicago, but he redrew it in order to file a more comprehensive case at the Federal High Court, which had prompted a country judge to dismiss the earlier case from the docket and cleared the path for Mr. Tiku Abubakar's federal complaint. My country people, this matter is very, very serious. Guys, is it that Tinibu did not actually attend this Chicago State University? Why is he so scared? What is he trying to hide? Why is Tinibu so afraid? This is to show that there must be something Tinibu is trying to hide. The way he quickly blocked the move by Atiku Abubakar in releasing his Chicago State University records. Guys, something is really fishing. So my country people, what are your thoughts on this? I'm dropping here. Kindly share your thoughts concerning this in the comment section. Thank you. Bye for now.